her healing powers. Stake her back to the castle, bro. Shoot, just don't let her near my deli tree. No wonder Cartoon Network's ratings are going down. So if you have not guessed by now, today's video is about the fall of Cartoon Network. In all honesty, I blame it on the fact that Adventure Time and Regular Show ended. Well, in all fairness here, we can't blame the network for this since Cartoon Network has a policy in which at most, the show can run for a maximum of around 7 or 8 seasons. The trouble all began when Cartoon Network started giving the green light to a bunch of random shows and their delusional fans. Now, think about it like this. When was the last time you watched an actually decent show on Cartoon Network? Besides the two I mentioned earlier. Like honestly, think about it and come up with an answer. The last time I actually liked a Cartoon Network show was years ago. The time of Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends and the life and times of Juniper Lee. Those certainly were the days when Cartoon Network was the supreme leader of animation. Yeah, supreme leader. Now we have shows like Uncle Grandpa. That title on its own already sends me down a spiral of crippling depression, man. That's like some bullshit. Uncle fucking Grandpa, damn. But for real though, who's in charge of giving these shows the green light? Cartoon Network really started giving shows like Uncle Grandpa and Teen Titans Go so much screen time and all for the sake of merchandise. Apparently, TTG is the lifeline of Cartoon Network as of the moment, to the extent that they even made a movie that is probably the most horrendous thing I've seen since Johnny Chess. Johnny really had a dog called Dookie. What the fuck, yo? I feel like in today's era of animation, CN is concentrated primarily on the younger audience and the younger delusional brain damaged fucking demographic. This is clear from shows such as Ben 10. No, not the other reboot. The new reboot. No, not the other reboot. The other, other reboot. Yeah, um, Cartoon Network really doesn't have any new ideas except for the shows that they cancelled and decided to bring fucking back. I'm talking about you, Young Justice. I think CN started to realize that they cannot just rely on Cyborg and Beast Boy dancing for a full on 5 minutes rapping about tacos and frozen pizza. Sure, I mean, we all like tacos and shit, but I mean, really now? Come on, CN. You've been a staple in the cartoon industry for years. Like, literally, I'm sure the only people who watch CN now are a bunch of 10 year olds. Am I the only one concerned about the state of the art style on CN lately for most of the shows? Should I even begin to talk about the new Pop of Girls? No. Okay, guess not. They even did the pop of girls dirty by adding that fourth girl with blue hair, who's black and who's big. LMO, shout out Chemical X. Now, but for real though, it's really sad to see how far CN's fallen from the spotlight. I can literally list a bunch of cartoons that were the literal shit. There was Samurai Jack, which, oh wow, would you look at that? CN had to bring back for a final season. No, 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 totally had nothing to do with the fact that they cancelled one of their best shows on a whim and brought it back because the network wasn't doing well. Nope. Totally has nothing to do with that. Then there was My Gym Partner is a Monkey, Squirrel Boy, Robot Boy, Shout Out My Boy, Gus and Constantine, and last but not least, one of the best shows to ever air on CN, but it gets no respect out here, was Chop Suki Chups. I think I butchered that, but whatever. Man, that show was the shit. But maybe, just maybe, CN's finally learning their lesson and deciding to switch things up on the network. They decided to green light Infinity Train. I really wish the green lit riding with Burgess. That show would have surpassed regular show. I don't care what you think. It did as would have been a top 10 cartoon. But anyways, yeah. You tell me what you think in the comments below. That's all I got for now. Until next time. Peace. We're playing this awesome game called Dragon's Fire. <laughs>